The waterways of Indianapolis are not as safe as you might think. Eighty times per year, Indy's streams and rivers overflow with hazardous sewage. These combined sewage overflows, or CSOs, pose potential health risks to anyone swimming, fishing, or boating in local waters. These combined sewage overflows are caused when Indianapolis receives one quarter inch of rain or more. Indianapolis' archaic sewer system is not able to handle and process this amount of wastewater runoff. So, the combined mixture of raw sewage from households and businesses and the stormwater runoff are released into local streams. These streams include Pogues Run, Pleasant Run, Fall Creek, Lick Creek, Bean Creek, Eagle Creek, and the White River. The sources of these discharges occur disproportionately in low-income and minority communities. Over half of Indianapolis's 144 sewage outflow points are located within a quarter mile of a park, a recreation center, or a school. While some waterways maintain warnings related to the hazards of CSOs, many people remain unaware and, or do not adequately comprehend the specific health dangers associated with CSOs. The primary risks include exposure to dangerous bacteria such as E. coli, viruses, parasites, pesticides, fecal chloroform, and toxic chemicals. Avoid exposure with contaminated streams 72 hours after rainstorms. If you contact river water after a CSO event, wash your hands immediately. Citizens Energy is undertaking a massive construction project that will virtually eliminate these discharges. However, it will not be completed until 2025. In the meantime, you can stay informed by signing up for email, Facebook, or Twitter CSO Discharge Alerts through Citizens Energy's website.